Hello, royal folks. It's good to see you all here again. This is your regular dose of royal news and analysis. But before we start, please subscribe to my channel and click the bell icon. Thanks. Lady Louise Windsor has increasingly gained the respect and affection of many members of the public over the past few years, since she started making public appearances alongside her parents, the Earl and Countess of Wessex. Given the teenager's apparent dutiful nature, as well as Sophie and Prince Edward's commitment to supporting the crown through their work, speculation has been swirling on whether Louise will ever take on royal duties, as well as the HRA style and title of princess she has been entitled to since birth as the granddaughter of the late monarch. Royal commentator Richard Fitzwilliams believes it is unlikely the public will know what the future holds for Lady Louise and what she desires to do before she finishes her four-year-long English course at St. Andrews University. He told Express.co.uk, At the moment there are no plans for Lady Louise Windsor to become a working royal. She will be studying English at St. Andrews University. During the last year, she has appeared in public more, at events marking the Platinum Jubilee and also most movingly at the vigil with her cousins in Westminster Abbey. She has inherited her late grandfather Prince Philip's love of carriage driving. There has been speculation for some time as to whether she might undertake royal engagements in the future. In an interview in 2020, the Countess of Wessex said her children would be likely to work for a living. After the passing of the Queen and Prince Philip, many institutions remain without a royal patron, and it is unclear how they will be distributed in a royal family, which is already slimmed down. When she has completed her education at St. Andrews, we will know more. Buckingham Palace announced over the summer the youngest granddaughter of the late monarch would start attending in September the same Scottish university where the Prince and Princess of Wales met in 2001. As noted by Mr. Fitzwilliams, Louise's mother Sophie had previously said she thinks it unlikely her daughter will start using her title, a move that would be likely associated with a decision to carry out royal duties, during an interview with the Sunday Times magazine. Speaking in the summer of 2020, the Countess said, We try to bring Lady Louise and James, Viscount Severn, up with the understanding they are very likely to have to work for a living. Hence we made the decision not to use HRH titles. They have them and can decide to use them from 18, but I think it's highly unlikely. Nevertheless, the royal family may need a new working members, given the advanced age of several of the senior royals it currently counts among its ranks, and the large number of associations that have been left without a patron following the death of Queen Elizabeth II in September and Prince Philip in April last year. While both the late monarch and her husband had passed on some of their patronages and military associations to younger members of the firm while they were still alive, hundreds of organizations have not been reallocated to other royals and face losing their cherished links with the monarchy. Lady Louise is known to have been very close to both the late Queen and Duke of Edinburgh, and in her first ever televised interview aired in September 2021 for the BBC's documentary Prince Philip, the royal family remembers she candidly spoke about sharing her passion for carriage driving with her grandfather. So what do you think guys, please share your thoughts in the comments. Until then thanks for watching, we'll see you again with some more interesting news about royal family. Thank you.